your boss lady from drjays.com and I'm here with Leah McSweeney who What's is up? the the boss lady of Married to the Mob. <laughs> Leah, I interview a lot of uh, founders and creative directors for a lot of our brands and a lot of them are men and I'm such a pleasure to be here with you today. Thank you. We're excited. We've won a Married to the Mob on drjays.com for a minute now and it, it's finally arrived. Yep. Now I know there's a really interesting story behind how you started the brand. Right. <laughs> I, a story I'm sure yeah. many of our customers will appreciate. Right. Speak to okay. the people, what happened? Well, basically I had started the company in 2004, but earlier in 2001, um, I got into a little altercation with the cop um, in Times Square because he was beating up my friend for no reason. I threw a bottle at him, whatever. He ended up punching me in the face and knocking one of my teeth out. And um, I sued um, the state of New York for the city of New York and I won a pretty good grip of money, more money than I had ever seen in my entire life. So I used that money to basically quit my day job and live off of and be able to just focus solely on Married to the Mob. I don't think. Had I not done that, I wouldn't have been able to grow the brand. I'd be right. too busy trying to work and make money just to live instead of focusing on the company. Mm. Um, and I bought like my Mac computer and like painted the walls pink in my grandmother's apartment and like made that into my office. So you'd so. always wanted to start a clothing line? You know, I've wanted to do everything, you know, but right. I think when I was younger. As us women do. Exactly. Yeah, right, but right. when I was younger, I remember definitely being in like, you know, sixth grade or seventh grade and being like, I want to be a fashion designer. You know, definitely. Yeah. I mean, fashion was always my thing. Mm. Like I always was obsessed with clothing, even when I was like in kindergarten. You but know? that's a crazy story. You know, obviously police brutality or, you know, incidents, incidents with the police. It happens to a lot of people, yeah. but you were able to turn a negative into a very big positive, obviously. Yeah, no, yeah. I mean, now that I look back on it, it was great. I'm glad it happened, mm. as crazy as that sounds, but mm. I don't know if I'd be, you know, And you have T-shirts that with your, My mug your mug shot yeah, on them. It's not the prettiest picture, but oh well. <laughs> uh -oh. <laughs> it's really not. Yeah, but you know, I mean, so was the t-shirt one of the first things that you... No, that came later. I actually that did that later. Mm -hmm. yeah. All right, so what is Married to the Mob? Where'd you get the name from, Married to the Mob? All right, well, I always say that the name chose me, but um, basically, you know, when I started the company, um, it was at a time where we had something, we don't really have it anymore, but it's called the Retail Mafia. And it was Married to the Mob, A-Life, a New York thing, Sir, J Money. Um, I think that's it. Sorry if I'm leaving anyone out. But, uh, and we were the only girl brand, so we'd be like, we're married to the mob, mm -hmm. you know, or whatever. And then MOB right. was Most Official Bitches, uh -huh. which was like my friends, you know, that's what we call ourselves. So. Um, it kind of just came together mm -hmm. like that. All right, cool. How would you describe a married to the mob girl? Um, let's see. She's feisty. <laughs> she's um, very sure of herself and what she thinks, and she's not afraid to speak her mind, and she doesn't care, you know, what people are gonna say. Um, yeah, that's pretty much the main thing, I think. When we started the company, basically, it's hoodies and T-shirts, and even though we have a full collection now you know, we're staying true to the brand. We always offer like as many hoodies and t-shirts as possible. But um, this is the candy stripe hoodie. It's pretty, it's basic, but it's one of our best sellers. I think girls like love the colors and the stripes going on and the big lip embroidery. And there's also the Married to the Mob logo hit on the sleeve. Mm -hmm. And um, everything has our, our, our trim all has our logos on it and stuff like that. So who, do, who, your head designer as well? Or you have yeah, a team I, of designers? I work, I work with a designer okay. and we pretty much do it all together. Wow. Yeah. So it's a very small team pretty much. Yeah. yeah. I mean, but then we'll always ask our whole staff their opinion. Not like our whole staff is that big. It's basically four <laughs> girls. But we always ask them, do you like this? Would you guys wear that? You know, what are you feeling right now? Or would you wear a skirt in the fall? Or, you know, always that kind of stuff. Right. So it's everybody's input. Okay, cool. Yeah. This is like that pullover. Um, I think I'm kid sisters wearing this in our um, campaign, but it's really cute on. It's like kind of boyish, but still like sexy, you know? Right. Mm -hmm. yeah. um, this is a sneak peek into fall. I'm gonna show my favorite pieces. This is our take on the M65 jacket. Um, and you'll see this um, pattern, you know, in um, the collection. Sorry, I'm saying um so much. No, 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 no. <laughs> and this is also water resistant. So it's not only really cute, but it's functional as well. <laughs> so that's a good thing. And this is a really cute flannel shirt dress that's like very short, especially when you tie it. And it has our lip embroidery and our um, logo gold plate, where it's actually gunmetal. <laughs> and that's it. I don't want to. I don't want to divulge too much. Right. Of all, so. Oh, okay. So, okay. so this is a sneak peek. Those are my two 
No, no, no. I love this dress. I love this dress. All right, so check out Married to the Mob. It's on drjays.com now. Spring is the first season that we have. Leah, Married to the Mob. Look out for some big things coming between us, collaborations and all that kind of stuff. Thank you so much. Thank you.